We bring in the studio this morning one of the gay rights activists, Mr. Should I call you Mr. Sure. Pepe Julian Onzima. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for Good morning. Morning to you. Why are you gay? What? Why it's dead ass. What? Just say god damn it and then not say anything else. It's all out a lot very green. You realize you, that's like the main thing that you cannot do. True, I can't pay attention. This is mostly because we... Saul is it funny. Neither are you. That's true, but you're the problem here, not me. I don't need to carry the whole stream. Yes, you do. No, I do not, and that shouldn't, that shouldn't be placed on me. Well, then place it on somebody else and bring somebody here. I'm just gonna add somebody random in my friends list that is online to this game. So, add, add a random person to this call. We just interview them. Just somebody who you have, who you barely ever spoken to. Not one of your actual friends. I'm the perfect person. How do I add them to this? You go to the little one that, that has the person waving and it has the uh, plus mark. Oh yeah, I see it. Um, alright. All I know is that his name, I think is Thomas. I don't know. <laughs> it's ringing him. It's ringing him. It's ringing him. Pick up. Pick up. If he doesn't pick up, he's getting kicked immediately. That fair? Yeah, sure. Uh, he didn't pick up. He's getting kicked. Kick him. Remove him. Remove him. I did it! Jeez, Saul, you got you gotta learn to lay off. Well, you mean? Add somebody else now. Um, Ugetsu autistic twin. Ugetsu autistic twin. Who might this person be? Why isn't Vincent in this? Why is what? Moderator. Moderator, Vincent is one of my most trusty allies. Why isn't he in here? He's not an up, Chuck. Come on, pick up. Come on. If he does join, he's only gonna stay for a little bit. And you're gonna kick him? Yes. What if he's really funny? I think we got ourselves a new up, Chuck. I don't know, what are we gonna ask him? Ask him the, um, sure, I'm gonna ask him the Schrodinger's blowjob oh. question. Come up with a hypothetical. Buddy! Power Yo. friend. So you're currently on a live recording of the Upchucks, and we need to ask you some questions for content. Alright. Alright, so... How old is this a hypothetical kid? How, how old is this kid? I do not know. I do not know this person at all. Oh, imagine if you will. We're getting the greatest sloppy toppy chrome dome you have ever gotten in your life. But you have a blindfold on. Now, if you take what? this blindfold off and you see who's actually giving it, it could scar you for life. It could be your neighbor's fireman's cat for all you know, or it could be like Ariana Grande. You take the blindfold off. No. Okay. That's your question. If you were given the chance to meet the Geico Gecko, but you would die once you meet him, would you take him up on that opportunity? Yes. The Gecko is my favorite insurance. Okay, and this, this kid is like 12. Uh, get him out. Get him out of this group chat. <laughs> Alright. Inviting another person. Um, I don't have like any friends online right now. Don't put your friends here. Hold on, let me see. Oh, I don't have anybody on my wait. I have somebody. I've got a couple possibly add. Wait, this is one of your friends. Don't invite one of your friends. It isn't. I have friend I have people that I don't know in my friends list. So do I. So if this is somebody that you know you're getting kicked out of the up shop. I don't know this person. I met them in the breaking bad Discord server. Likely, uh. sir. Likely story. Fuck. We'll share my screen to you and show you the <laughs> only question that we've ever had. Yeah. Hey, watch this. Watch this. Let's go to Foxy. You see it? You see it. Get this. Oh, this is it. Doctored, mister. This is it. What are DM? What are your DMs like with Terrell? <laughs> Slander. I don't know. This is literally it. Go down. I want to see more of your DMs. Um, that is highly incriminating, and you you would look down on me. Um, this. I don't remember. Um, I DMs with Alatar. <laughs> Yo, what? you sent him. Um, DMs with Robbie. <laughs> I love Dire of a Wimpy Kid memes. Falling on you with the pick and roll. You don't even play in your sickle mode. You get them to join the server too. Subsidy channel. I just really need to insist on that. Which we need this. Join Dennis. Join what? The server. Tell them no, they cannot stay muted. Fucking <laughs> Oh my god, my turn. 
Alright, did you remove, remove them? Remove no. them, they don't deserve it. Remove Foxy, they don't deserve to be here. Move. I had a furry. What? I had a furry if we clown on them. I don't know, I think that girl is- Oh, what? wait, Zoo? What? What are you guys trying to do? Oh, we're just bringing in random people into the call, just to, uh... So interview them for content. Captain Brett, now that you're here, I can finally talk about my big... So, the other day, I was on the Spider-Man ride at Universal Studios, you know? Yep. And, you know, I got to thinking, man, you know, at, at the beginning of those rides, all those villains, you know, like, Shocker and stuff, they all go, you're in for a shock and all, all that stuff like that. So, I come, I have come up with a villain of my own. Have you? Yeah. What's your... I call him the Nut Twister. Oh. That that sounds like you. Yes, um, his big power. He has a stick, and when he jams it in the ground, yeah, he twists your nuts. Like everyone in that radius, or just yours? Everybody in that radius. What good? What? So he's a super villain now. What, yes. Why is he super villain? What happened? And what about women? What if he's fighting a woman superhero? Yeah. What is it oh, yeah. Them? What happens then? Twist their ovaries or something. Oh they God. Grow, they, they, grow no. they grow a penis. Yeah, they grow a penis. Yeah, they grow nuts and then they're twisted. No, no. We can't go on with that. He turns them into a fuda for about no! five minutes. No. No. The bad ending. <laughs> If you can't speak about that. You know who's really into that, man? What would be? What? What? Yes, he's very into that. Don't DM him about it right now. He's really I'm into I'm not gonna do that. No. I'm gonna send you links. No. Who left? What do you think? I accidentally just personally called Max. You have a okay, habit of doing that. I do, because I, I don't know why they just... Yeah, it's stupid. <laughs> I hate the Discord setting for it. Why is he not here? He's normally always here. He's in Israel. Going what? to Israel to get drone strike. Why is he going to Israel? He can't deal with this anymore and he wants to die in a funny way. What? Well, I, I mean, I mean, okay. Sure, sure. Anyways, he didn't pick up and it's still raining. So hopefully he answers because I want to question him. Oh, he didn't answer. Oh, well, I was going to ask him about it, but I guess not. How do you say a boot like that? Oh! A <laughs> Copyrighted. Yeah, that is copyrighted. Wait, is it really? Probably. Yeah. What isn't copyrighted at this point? We wish that YouTube poop will be fine. I mean, maybe. Oh, will we be fine, Andrew? Yes. I don't know. I don't think we'll be fine. The channel's gonna get deleted when we hit like 2k. True. We'll laugh and goof and gaff and giggle. He's gonna laugh. If the channel gets deleted, I will go personally to the YouTube headquarters and I will wreak havoc. Don't do that. Didn't that already happen? Wasn't that like a thing? Yeah, this, I'm not like, talking our... about shooting. I'm not talking about anything. Don't I, I was, I was gonna say. I I'm mean, cause this are, this already cartoon kind of havoc, not anything bad. You're gonna bring like Humanity. a you you alluded to it. You alluded to it. I did not be... allude to it. Yeah, you did. Cartoon mallet. Yes, I will bring a big cartoon mallet. He's gonna pull some Tom and Jerry stunts. I wanna do like a Looney Tunes style war. Have I told you about this? I, I don't know. I don't think so. I wanna I... shoot a war movie and have a single scene like a Looney Tunes style, like really wacky graphic violence. That'd be kind of funny. Would be, but it would be like saving. Get yeah, Nedry to animate it. Nedry, we need you. Oh, we I need you to well. animate the film. We need you to animate Saul Goodman's or Batman's film. I want it to be live action. I think it'd be funnier. Oh, he wants it to be live action. Sorry, Nedry, you're getting caught. But still, no, but still, still animated. So, what's gonna happen is, it's gonna like be- Like Space Jam kind of thing, where it's like both? No, 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 it's gonna be in Vietnam. Oh, of hmm. course. Vietnam, and they're paratrooping into the, the, the jungle. Yep. And his parachute gets caught on a tree, and he like slams into the tree, Looney Tune style. He peels back off the tree and falls down like you know like tumbling but still defying gravity uh -huh. he, around. he goes like six feet under and there's a perfect imprint of his body he gets back up and there's like birds on his head and yep. somebody pulls him back up and they go back into a bloody war zone nice okay i'm following nedry can I'm you animate this and then I would just put that into a very serious war movie. Nedry, we need you. I wouldn't need even... to do what? Animate uh, the film. Get started. It's that simple. You should do art streams. He I did do art streams. They were that good. Yeah, they weren't. They didn't really catch on. <laughs> oh, okay. he's spitting. What is he spitting? At? Anyways, I must part ways once again. Oh. Typically, what I do here. But yeah, I don't know.
What, do, are the Mounties coming after you? <laughs> Fucking red men on horses. And if you have to commit mass genocide in one country, what country do you choose? Okay, which Asian country is it gonna be? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Why Asian country immediately? I don't know, because I feel like saying Africa is a bit too racist, even though, let, let's be real, those are the countries nobody cares about. What about South Africa? South Africa, is there anything in there? The Elon Musk, um, Bell Delphine. Bell Delphine's from Africa. She's South African. Number 15. Burger King foot lettuce. That's last copyrighted. Burger is someone's foot fungus. I don't think it is. <laughs> okay, so what Asian country are you picking? Don't pick a country where they will come after you. If you say that you're gonna genocide their country. Why not a, um, European country? Guys, you cannot be zoning out while we're talking about hypotheticals. What, what, what happened? What happened? <laughs> what, what happened? You cannot be zoning out while we talk about hypotheticals, okay? Alright, well, what's your hypothetical? I have to genocide a random country. You can only pick one and there will be no repercussions. Is, this, is Istanbul a country? Istanbul, yeah. Are you uh, gonna genocide? Yeah, I guess that. Why? I don't know, it's just a funny name. What about Kazakhstan? What about who? Kazakhstan. Kagestan? Kazakhstan. Or Stan, or whatever. <laughs> From Borat. Uh, I don't know. You're telling me you would not genocide Kazakhstan? No. Why? Why? From the police. I don't know. This isn't a good We're... hypothetical, say something else. Have to genocide the entire cast and crew of one TV show. There will be no repercussions. <laughs> What show are you picking? We already said the Steven Universe. I, no, but even the crew, like everyone who worked on it? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I don't even hate Steven Universe, to be honest. You know, I just... Out of I every just kind of want them all dead who worked on that show. That's, that's how I feel. <laughs> that includes all the Chinese sweatshop workers that they yeah, outsourced so their cartoon panels to. They credited every single, like, Chinese sweatshop worker. Pretty funny. You didn't do that. Chris, what's your favorite Disney cartoon? Disney cartoon? I don't know. Finny Herb? Yeah, it's a me. basic one, but, like, who the fuck cares about Disney cartoons? Me, it's either Phineas and Ferb or Gravity Falls. Gravity Falls. Hot up, Gravity Falls was good. You're mid, Dennis. You're mid. I just gave you the finger even though you can't see me. <laughs> WarioWare makes me have unbridled rage. Then stop playing it. Oh, why would I stop playing it? It gives me money. You don't know how much I wow, wish I could just- Wow, these are super low poly. I don't know how much I wish I could like scream and yell and go on more rants. Do it! Do it right now! I can't. I live in a house with other people. Nobody wants to hear that. Who do you live with? Parents. Both of them? Yeah. Good for that's you. you. Is that surprising? In America? Yeah. You just said that all black children have never met their fathers. No, I didn't say that. Max said that. Go talk to him right now. He really? Yeah. Hi, wait, what's the context of that, though? He just said it out of the blue. He just said a bunch of racist things out of the blue. He really? Did you get it on recording? Yes, I did. Where is it? Yeah, he dropped the Edward with a hard R like 28 times. Are you being serious? Yes, I can't I'm being, I, I'm being like serious. When? Like yesterday. <laughs> yesterday. This is a very weird girl. Okay. This is sexual harassment that's driving. This is I, I don't trust this girl. She's like, what do you call a furry but for insect? Scaly? No, uh fucking incel? I don't know. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I just said to run real quick, man. Give me a break, man. Okay. So I guess that I missed a bug. Blowing bubbles, blowing Zaza. You got big old titties. I said goo goo, goo gaga. As I'm currently trying to get a furry on stream so that we can make fun of them. Yeah, but you know that furry, so no, we can't make fun of them. You don't know them personally. Right, the rule is no people that I actually know in real life. Or no interact with them ton on Discord. I mean, interact with them, but I don't like them. No, I know who you're talking about, no. What, Dan Santel? George Constantana. That's, oh, is that furry who joined the server? Yes, that you threw a hissy fit about. And yeah, then they left. That's who I'm trying to get to join. You can get them to join the server, but you can't put them on the call. Why? You furry phobic? I'm telling Alatar. 
A furry phobic. Hamburger cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper. Hamburger cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper. Hamburger oh, cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper. Salt, 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 salt. Could you, like, yeah. could you actually, Whopper. like, stop playing random clips? Like, even if, like, they're a copyright strike, or not cop- if, if they're copyright safe, it's, like, annoying, to be honest. And I have to edit it out most of the time, so. Told you I was doing it at the beginning of the f recording and didn't have a problem with it. I fight with the bra noise. Okay, I'm just gonna play the bra noise. Cause I I you finished can play the video. It out. You can play it for an hour at random intervals. We already did an hour. We already sat through the entire hour. I had to restart it. Bruh. Yes, we'll restart it. I'm just gonna put it on loop. How long have we been recording? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's copyrighted. I want to like people. I want to go out and do that and where it's like pull on the street and ask them what they're listening to. But just tell them to stop and that it's copyrighted. Like get really upset and start like yelling. Punch them. Oh, that's assault. You can't do that. Assault is fun. No, not really. Aggravated assault is funny, but regular assault isn't funny. Well, what's what's the difference? Um, aggravated assault, you were provoked. Well, no, how is that? It's not funny. It is because that means the other person most likely fought back. It has a little triforce on it. Wow. Get it. Get what? What? Get, is the best way to move around? You just like, hold on, wait. Yes, it's a fast <laughs> way to move around. All right, the guide said that there's some enemy gay. And there's some enemy gays. That's what they called them in the, in the, the fucking guy. It's their official name. They're called the gays. Like, is it a term for homosexual or are they happy? No, that's just the name of the bird. They're like very happy birds? Potentially, I wouldn't know. They listen to Free Bird by Leonard Skinner? I guess. Potentially, I don't know what the naming origin is. I thought the guy who made the game was just like incredibly homophobic. You know what, it's Japan, that's potentially. Oh, they draw the line at being gay. Like, being a pedophile is fine, but they draw the line at being gay. Burger cheese, burger big mac whopper. That's what she said. What would it take for you? How much money? Let Ganondorf have his way with you for not an hour, an hour and thirty minutes. If I'm getting money, that's only because I can. Would you like, say I the would do it for free, but I want to let anybody know that. Would you say the ugliest character in Legend of Zelda is Link? To be honest, how much money would it cost to let Midna her way with you? Not true for Midna. Uh. Well, listen, all I'm saying is that if Minna is, is, is a short stack, not a lolly. This is confirmed by the developers of Zelda. You sure about that? I am tired of this misinformation being spread. It's not true for Minna. It's a lot of money. A little money? A lot of money. Minna, but not a lot for Ganondorf. About true for Midna. A lot of money. Why? Because I don't fuck. Literally just said you would fuck his face for free. Yeah, but that's Ganondorf. He has Vilgax energy. No. Like, I'm 100% straight, but you know, anybody with Vilgax energy, I was just like, alright, I'll just fuck. It's not straight at all, then. It's the exact opposite. So, there's rules. This is okay, because anybody who radiates Vilgax energy, you could fuck without it being gay. Oh. It's because you have no choice in the matter, so it's like, you know, it's not gay. Yes, you do, actually. No, I don't! You, you think do. Grandpa Max has a choice in all? All four of those images? Yes. No, he does not. He has a choice in the secret fifth one. It's the secret fifth one. He's riding one. on Vilgax's car. I haven't seen that one. Well, go look for it. Search up Vilgax at that. It's surprisingly easy to find. I'm not sure oh, why, these are, why, why there's five of these images. I don't think I will. I don't think I'm going to. Dennis is now um, on... Um, this is now on recording, telling a miner to go look up porn. That's all I hate you. I hate you too, buddy. Are you gonna cut that out now? Yes! Hey. <laughs> this is the type of stuff that's almost getting you kicked out. Why? It was funny. It was funny, though. Where's the girl, bug? It was funny, though. It most certainly was not. Yes, it was. 
Well, it was funny to me because I'm allowed to make that kind yes, of joke. Yes, well, you make those, you continue to make those kind of jokes and I'm picking you out. I'm all you have. There's a joke, please do not fire me. I'm just sitting and waiting for monetization. I think there's at least one upchuck who secretly only is here to wait for monetization. Yeah. Who do you think it is? If it had to be one, who do you think it is most likely to be? Alright, my dad called me, sorry. Alright, well, if there was- if there was gonna be one upchuck- Rookie. Rookie? Who's Rookie? Rookie. Oh, rookie. 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 Keys. Rookie's nuts. Are you serious to match us in the N-word, though? No! No, are you hearted? Yeah. Of course he did it! Don't believe anything I say! <laughs> I mean, I could see, I could definitely see Alatar saying it. Yeah, I could see Alatar saying it. Alatar has see... like a trans. Oh, Alatar has like a transatlantic accent. I have no idea what that means, but I'm sure he it does. Like, sounds like a movie star from the '50s, and it's not good. It's not a compliment. Gay for Alatar. Do you want to kill you? I will skin and eat you alive. <laughs> Have I told you that it's not that cannibalism isn't inherently illegal? It's the way that you get the meat. You know, this is the second time that a black person has told me this. <laughs> what? What was the first time? <laughs> I don't know. I just wanted me to be friends with some kid, and like you know, he likes old video games too. So I was like, you know what? Sure, I'll take the lad under my wing. But then he just started talking about cannibalism and philosophy. I just kind of just associated myself with him after that. You're not inherently bad. <laughs> Yeah, but you know, he was really heavy into the cannibalism stuff, and it is the feds. I'm like, sure it was probably for like an actual like study or whatever, a smart person thing, but like, I don't know, I just couldn't deal with the cannibalism at the time. Was he a cannibal? I don't think so. You should have like asked him if he wanted to try it. If he said yes, he would have ran away and called the police, but he tried to butt rape you. He did not. We did not interact. He did not have that happened. He did not, he did not come back to my school the next year. <laughs> He got arrested for cannibalism, I'm telling you. No, it wasn't cannibalism, actually. It was underage yeah. drinking, actually. The arson. So he did actually get arrested. Yes, for he underage was, drinking. He was prepping for the cannibalism. He needed to prepare himself. No, I just think that he wants to drink underage, man. You blame him. You can go fight for your country and die at, at 18, but you can't drink until you're 21. Yeah. This is where... Bruh. This is where... <laughs> Bro was so beautifully played. But, uh, yeah. Yes, I'm going to give you my actual home address, and I want you to send me a box of goodies. No. Why? I don't feel like it. It's gonna be like a bunch of, like, used tissues, a baby-sized shoe, half-eaten Milky Way bar. I haven't had Milky Ways in a while. They're good. They're Milky bars. Way is my favorite candy bar. It is. It is a good one. Yeah, it is my favorite. That's what I'm doing tomorrow. Guess so, what I'm you doing? Harass one celebrity. Who would it be? Um, <laughs> harass like nicely harass or harass to the point where they like break down and cry. Whatever. Tom Cruise. I think it'd be funny because nobody's ever really done it before. You don't really harass Tom Cruise. Who, do, who would you harass? I would just Aaron Hansen. Why Aaron Hansen? He's not even a celebrity like that. Okay, okay who, who, what internet celebrity would you harass? Matt Watson. Matt Watson? It, I think it'd be funny. To the point oh. tears? <laughs> no, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. <laughs> No, 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 that'd be too mean. I wouldn't want to do that to Matt Jackson Tucker. Jackson Tucker? How do you think that whole lawsuit thing's going? I feel like he's going to be placed as a felon. I think they're gonna hit him with everything they have. Possibility. I thought it was a joke at first. It still could be. No. You don't know I don't, that. I don't think it would be a joke. I think this would have gone on too long. Yeah. They would have addressed it if it was a joke. No, they're playing the long game. Don't don't buy into this. Just keep up posting in the comments about how it's a joke, loyal up truck mice. This this let's play channel is gaslighting you. Don't don't let them fool you. The up trucks would never gaslight you like this, and this is why we're the channel. I'm listening. Trust Dennis. Do not trust Dennis. Fucking Dennis is a liar. And I would never edit out anything Saul says out of the up truck. So I would definitely oh. not like cut out any of the things that he's saying. Maybe if he was whispering something, I would definitely not cut that out. Why help does my throat still hurt? What the fuck? Okay, help me, please, Dennis. <laughs> me hostage in a basement. I look, I'm at 308 Albuquerque, New Mexico. 308 Negro, Arroyo in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Please come help me. He just, he 
He he beats me every day and he won't feed me. I can't have water. I, I'm, I'm frail. I'm brittle bones. He's gonna kill me, dude. Oh, okay, yeah, so uh, we'll do Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Oh, Dennis, I heard the CCP is back. I heard too. What are we gonna oh, do? After their, their last crusade against the Upchucks, I don't know how they're gonna feel now. I don't know either. Oh, I'm still mad at you for not helping me out and, um... I was playing Pikmin Free. What was I supposed to do? <laughs> You're supposed to come get me, bro. They were gonna tie him and square me. They were gonna tie me up and tie him and square. And that's my problem. How? Could you imagine if, like, I was actually being held hostage by the Chinese? Like, you just, like, thought it was very funny. They posted my ransom to you for some reason. Like, you just laughed at it. They show this beaten and bloody teenager. <laughs> You're just laughing. It's like, haha, that's funny. Thanks, guys. You're like, thanks, G. What would I do without you? You're on a first name basis with Xi Jinping. No, I'm on a first name basis with him. That's what I just said. King no, idiot. I'm on a first name basis with him. This isn't funny. I'm on a first name basis with him. I'm now refusing to continue this episode of Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess until Dennis acknowledges that this joke is not funny. You know who's really not funny? You. <laughs> Man, imagine watching one of these videos. But vi yeah, nobody watches this. This is like incoherent babblings of children. Yeah, it literally is. <laughs> I would rather watch a baby go goo goo gaga and poop in a diaper. Yeah, that has more substance, like educational value than the upchucks, yes. At least it's funny. Jokes will always be funny. Lowbrow vulgar humor will always be funny. And I don't, I don't care what you say. Yo, dog, can I get some ice cream? Yo, Dennis, what's not plus 10? Yo, Dennis, what's not plus 10? 9 plus 10. Yeah, yo, Dennis, what's not plus 10? You keep on repeating the same thing, it's not funny! You haven't answered yet, what is 9 plus 10? Don't know, I don't care. Alright, so everybody, Dennis is a fucking retard. You're a retard, Saul. Shut up, I'll kill you. Saul, can I speak to your mother? Oh. <laughs> you can, actually. Why? Why do you want to speak to my mother? No reason. Oh, tell me why, pussy boy. Tell her a very important message. What's the message? What is the message, Dennis? What is the message, Dennis? She's gonna want to hear it. Where's the bug? Hey, Dennis, I have my mom right here with me. What do you need to say? Hello, ma'am. I'm with Discord. Your son has been posting pornography across various Discord servers and, uh... Hey, she Wait, already knows I you know does that. Nobody knows I does that. Did you actually put her on the phone? Oh, you fucking retard. You think I am, but not that dumb. Dennis, I'm going to end your life, okay? You know what? Can... Not talking is funnier than you. I said it. Fuck you. Right, you can choose how you die. How do you choose to die? It has to be related to the upshot. See so, out, yep, because... Can anything in your life ever be not related to the Upchucks? No, this is who I am now. Death will be in vain if it is not related to the Upchucks. <laughs> yes. Uh, these bras are just beautifully placed. Am I right or am I right? I don't know, dude. Uh, this is gay. <laughs> Dennis is the first openly gay upchuck. Yes, do we have any openly gay upchucks? Alatar, I guess. Is he gay? Yeah. That makes sense. And Robbie's openly something. I, I don't know what it is. But good Robbie, for her. Is, Robbie is openly a 14 year old girl. Man, yeah, she's older than that. Robbie is openly a 15 year old girl. Man, yeah, she's older than that. Robbie is openly a 15 and a 1 fourth month old girl. She's older than that. What do you know? I've known her for like two years. You've seen her birth certificate. <laughs> yes, I have. Thank you very much. You haven't, you dirty liar. That's right, I said it. What are you going to do about it? To write nothing. I thought, put boy. This is gay. Dennis, on a, one, on a scale of one to Alatar, how gay are you? Low. I mean, I don't- Listen, Saul, you're not that funny. I don't know how to respond to that. Yeah, this is you're not- This long gaps. You aren't funny. Well, I'm the only one talking. But right, I'm just well, gonna- then, you know what? Tell a story to our viewers. Okay, um, once upon a time in a land far, far away, there was a man named, uh, Genghis. And Genghis was the greatest fiddler the world had ever seen, and he traveled the earth, sang his fiddle for everybody who, who wanted to listen. And then- when Genghis was in, um, 
Georgia country, not the not the place in the United States of America, was poached. Another man named Grangis. Grangis was like Nega Genghis. It was like basically Genghis, but better. And Genghis and Grangis, it, they stared at each other, they looked up and down, and then they decided to have a fiddle off. And this fiddle off, it was it was one for the ages. Then. It, they, they fiddled and fiddled. They actually went through like five fiddles because all the other fiddles broke. Then, uh, Angus and Grangis, they were all fiddled out. They're on the stage looking at each other. Everybody's cheering. They look each other passionately in the eyes and have gay sex at the end. Not funny. You aren't. You're not funny either. I'm not. Well, I'm funnier than you. I'm the second funniest of Chuck. Yeah, that's only because people voted for you. Yeah. And they didn't vote for you. Up. Uh, you tell a story then. And it's can we can we can we write a pirate story one sentence at a time? All right. All right. You there start. There was an astronaut named Bob. Had a pirate. There once was an astronaut named Bob. And Bob had some silly dreams. Return, Dennis. Very silly dream. And this night, specific dream entailed a pirate. Yes, a, a pirate. Who was also an astronaut named Bob. <laughs> you. <laughs> well, on this specific day, this pirate astronaut named Bob is doing his day job as a pirate. Ever since Bob was a little Australian freckled red headed boy whose parents had been kidnapped Ooh. by aliens, he wanted to be an astronaut. Bob headed out for those piece of shit liberal aliens who stole his parents. His Bob was a Republican. A very big Republican. He owned 47 guns that he carried on him at all times. A lot of these guys are girls. It's your turn, Dennis. Oh, yeah, Bob was an astronaut. We know that. Oh, wait, is this a girl? This is a girl. And one day, while he was sailing the seven seas, he met anthropomorphic bowling pin. He couldn't help but notice. Yeah. There's a there's a little yeah. attractive looking slit on this no, 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 okay. bowling pin. Did you say? I said that the bowling pin had a vagina. Of course it did. And Bob immediately noticed his vagina and started to court the bowling pin. How fast did Bob come, you may ask? Did he? <laughs> what? They didn't fuck yet. Oh, well, he comes in his pad. He came in his pad. Very quickly. Quickly. How quickly, Dennis? These are the things that we need to know. Very quickly. Quickly is very quickly. Very. Okay, so the anthropomorphic bowling pin named Big Booty Bimbo Bitch walked Bob up and down and asked if she could come along on the ride. She did. <laughs> You're not setting up any jokes here. I am not. Hey, why do you- this- we're supposed to be going off of each other. Um, I had so a short while, attention span while there's all the you. While they were sailing the seven seas, Big Booty Bimbo Bitch started to ask Bob some questions. Some pretty big question. Speaking of big, did we tell you the length of Bob's penis? It is approximately 2.7 inches. <laughs> that is actually Based huge. on a real person's penis, that penis is Saul. Fuck you, I'm leaving. Okay. Is that a girl? I think that is. Got breath. That's not a girl. <laughs>